Speaking of all those trees, hopefully it won't be too cold when it's time to recycle them, but tonight <laughs> it's going to be a cold one and we saw some snow which is a lot of fun for some folks. Yeah, a lot of fun for some, not so fun for others. Kind of depends on where you are. Our roads, especially up in a far northwest Georgia, are a little slick, Rome included. This is our view right now over Rome. You can see a nice little dusting of snow there. Luckily, the snow has stopped at that location, so that's giving uh, GDOT some opportunity to get some crews out to those locations to really help out those icy roadways. For the rest of us, we're seeing some good snow now across portions of North Georgia, including inside the perimeter in downtown Atlanta. Snow, snowflakes are uh, falling pretty quickly. We've got a range of wintry precipitation that includes a cold rain, snowfall, sleet, as well as grapple, which is when those snowflakes fall and then raindrops kind of super cool onto them and freeze. They almost look like really soft hail. We're seeing reports of lots of types of wintry precipitation across the Atlanta metro area. It's currently where this wintry precip is the heaviest. This will continue as we move through the next couple hours eventually kind of tapering off into the overnight hours. It's really important to note that at least inside the perimeter for much of the Atlanta area, our current temperatures are still either at or above freezing. So although we are seeing uh, wintry precipitation, a cold rain, some flurries, at this point, it's not really having any impact to your road. We're still sitting at 35 in Atlanta. We're right at 32 in Marietta, 35 in Douglasville, 37 still in Fayetteville, and then 36 in Hampton, 34 up towards Chambly. So our temperatures right now are above freezing, but that won't necessarily be the case as we move towards the early hours of tomorrow morning. So because of that, we do have winter weather advisories in effect for portions of far northwest Georgia. These are in effect until 4 o'clock this morning, but based on uh, what we're seeing right now, the National Weather Service may end up uh, continuing these into portions of the early hours tomorrow morning. Light snow has led to some slick spots on road mainly up into the far northwest corner of Georgia already. So it's important to use caution if you are going to be driving late tonight or early tomorrow morning. And remember that your elevated roads, bridges, overpasses, those are typically the first to see that icy accumulation. Our forecast track has these wintry showers going down towards the south and the east, eventually clearing out within the next couple hours. So by 1, 2 o'clock, showers will be coming to an end and we'll be clearing to mainly sunshine by tomorrow morning. Your overnight low temperatures will be cold. We'll get down into the 20s, but afternoon high temperatures should be pretty comfortable. An improvement from where we've been the last couple of days with highs getting up into the 40s. If that's still too cold for you, temperatures continue warming the next couple of days. By Thursday and Friday, highs are into the 60s as we bring in our next chance for some rainfall. Some isolated showers possible by Friday afternoon, but it looks like Saturday could end up being a pretty soggy day across the state with scattered showers, potentially some heavy rainfall moving in as we wrap up this year and head into the new year. Some showers may linger into Sunday, but temperatures not really going to see much of a hit. Highs will be getting close to 70 degrees by January 1st.